Okay, recording in progress. <laughs> exactly, Hi, Carlitos. Peter. How are you? Woo! Fine, fine. I'm happy. <laughs> Me too. I'm so Thank you. I hear you. I hear you. Uh, good, good evening. Good evening, Bree. How are you, girl? Really? I'm fine, teacher. I'm so happy to see you. <laughs> Me too. I'm so happy too. I have uh, Ivy, this new one. Also, Gerardo and Michael. Oh, no, Michael. Uh, no, 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 Michael. I, I have. Uh, I have a memory. I think I, I already have you in class, right? Where's Michael you? is uh, was in level intermediate, pre intermediate number three. Yeah, yeah, I remember him, right? But uh, he was familiar for me. <laughs> I'm so happy, guys. I'm so, so happy. Okay, let me clean this camera. Yeah, much better, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy that I have you back. It's, it's amazing. Woo, yeah. Hey, you know what? Oh, and I have a, a new student here. Well, actually, I had three new students. Two dogs and one cat. Really? They are here, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, They're coming okay. close to mama to say, oh, who's with me mama today? Yeah, mm. hey, yeah, Carlitos, I'm so happy that I have you back yeah. again. Ah, you're gonna continue suffering. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> okay, teacher. Yeah, hopefully <laughs> you can also invent another recipe so you can also uh, enjoy the, the dinner with us, right? My wife invented the recipe. <laughs> but you know what? It was a really amazing recipe. Yeah. Actually, it was a really, I think it was a chicken salad, right? Chicken salad, yeah, yes. A Caesar chicken salad. I was like, oh, you know, Caesar what was the rice. problem? It yeah. depends the, the, what, what? The, the, these, uh, how do you say? Uh, the recipe. Salsa. The Sausage. Note. Yes. The Oh, you know what? I that day I think most of us haven't had our dinner, and he was really frustrated that Mr. Carlito was preparing everything and he started eating, and everybody's like, oh, Carlitos, please. Yeah. And you know what? I, I didn't I didn't know why Carlitos wanted that day to start like in a hurry that recipe and after that we found out that he wants to show us the presentation because he wants to start eating mm -hmm. so that was a reason why right Carlitos yes yes <laughs> hey. and guys tell me hey Dinita welcome to the jungle sorry welcome to class. Hi. hey you will continue suffering again right yeah 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 just like masochist right masochist i'm just kidding <laughs> not just teasing you guys oh i have my two pets here mm -hmm. all righty so tell me how was your weekend any news uh, no hey no. jesse welcome all fine all fine nothing new yeah. nothing special did you prepare no, something no, no. for your family? Did you go to a specific place? I don't know. Did you work? No, no, no. I ah. stay home you stay all home. weekend. <laughs> and, the, uh, and let me ask, this This question is specifically to Bree. Bree, <laughs> by any chance, did you fall asleep the entire weekend? Always, teacher. Always, I right? <laughs> all the weekend, yes. <laughs> I know, I know. She she has a Guinness record on that, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So she needs to defend her position in the Guinness record. Yeah, I, I know. Mm -hmm. That's why I asked her that, just in case. Anybody can win me. No, nobody, nobody can win you. No. Um, I, I am the best. It. I think I can win you. No. Yes. When I had the time to sleep. You can ask my husband. We hope he's not here, oh. but but I am a really bear. I'm a bear. Yes, I know. You know, I pref if you if you put me uh, in the balance, on the left side we have the food, and the right side we do have the, the bed. I will choose the bed all the time. <laughs> yeah, to recover my energy, and after that. Mm -hmm. I wake up and I look for something to eat, but I prefer to sleep better than to eat. Yeah. Just to recharge my batteries. 
<laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you see, she already started. <laughs> I I think Breeze is laying on a sofa or a hammock. Well, I don't know. Or you she's know, already I on the bed. It, I sit it in the chair right now. In, in the, the chair. Yes. <laughs> and she's falling asleep. Like this. No, 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 no. Right now, no. <laughs> I doubt it. Hopefully you're not, because today we're going to talk about a really interesting topic that you cannot <laughs> imagine. Guys, may I ask you something? We have Beatriz Duran, Rocio, Jamie, and Boris. Hey, Boris. Hey, Boris. Uh -huh. I think I have one Boris one day, but I don't remember. <laughs> yeah, I need to see your face, guys, because I have a lot of students that, you know what, it is sometimes really hard to, to remember all of you. I, re I remember, you know what, my mother is a teacher, but is she's already retired, right? She was uh, uh, 34 years being a, a teacher, can you imagine? Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, my mama said, well, so, sometime before the quarantine, we went to a shopping center and all the stuff, and there was a girl or a boy, I think it was a boy, to approach her and said, hi, miss, how are you? And start talking and talking. And my mama started talking and talking. And then they, they said, bye, miss, bye. And my mama said, you know what? What? I don't remember his name. <laughs> but I think he should be my one of my students. Because if not, she wouldn't say hi in my name. <laughs> but can you imagine? Uh, that guy was like 40 years old oh. and my mama used to give like classes like um fourth fifth and sixth grade so can you imagine that Oof. that was long time ago now she has oh, like no. i think she has almost like 10 years or 11 years of retired but i remember that then my mama said i, I remember some of you especially the one that gave me a lot of trouble right <laughs> when she was when they were at school but it, it's really impossible during 34 years to remember all the students names what do you think it's a little bit complicated right yes yeah yeah yes. it is and my mama used to be the ones that we said like um how what's the name of this type of teachers oh my god i forgot <laughs> And it's my mama. Thanks God. <laughs> uh, oh, what is it? What's up? What is the name? Oh, normalistas. Remember those kind of uh, teachers that were like. <laughs> student the normal is, student. Uh -huh, that is my mom's type. Yes. So can you imagine? <laughs> you know, I remember that when I had uh, classes at the university or at the school and I'm looking for uh, books to do my homework. Uh, every time in my class, it smells like study environment, right? So we have a lot of uh, bookcases, like three or four bookcases, and each bookcase has like a three devices, and each device has two columns or three columns of books. So my mama said, "Mama, I need to to look for this topic." And my mama said, "Okay, in the second bookcase, and the second <laughs> level, in the second line, look for this book, and search for wow. that." But you know what? I'm not gonna help you. You gotta look and search and read. So my mama never helped yeah. me. She guided me where to search for that. But you said, you know what? Because you need to learn how to be a good student. Okay. So that's the way I always raise it. To look and to read a lot. And we were like <laughs> six kids. So can you imagine? <laughs> can you imagine how many books we had? Now I don't have anything of those because there was like... Um, book fair especially like a fepade fair book fair so you need to go and and donate the books so basically that's what i did donate the books because i'm not gonna use them anymore like, can you imagine how many books i had so that's the way my mom raised me but you know what i like it because she helps me to become a good student and to search for that information and to read and to study. I like that. 
but you know what? I, I was not a common teenager, but hey, but talking about moms and and kids and teenagers and everything, <laughs> you know what? This is gonna be today's hot topic because basically not everything is the red roses, right? Uh, sometimes we have a complaints. You know what complaints are? Complaints? Any idea? Yes, Inita. Miguelito, Carlito, do you know what complaints is? You know what that word means? No. 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 no, no, no. Um, complaints. Complaints. No, 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 that is compliment. Complaints oh, is como quejas o desacuerdos. Oh, yeah, between, between uh, teenagers and parents, right? Mm -hmm. Especially because when we were kids, guys, my mama said yes or no, do this, do that, stay there and move, whatever. And you follow their instructions, right? But when you are growing a little bit, sometimes it's not easy to handle teenagers, right? Maybe we were really nice teenagers, maybe not. Maybe Brie was a really complicated teenager, I don't know. Maybe Carlitos, I don't know. Alex, I don't think so. <laughs> uh, but you look at his face like <laughs> teacher if you can't talk with my mama you should ask a lot of questions about me when I was a teenager okay Miguelito looks really nice and Jorgito mm, Jorgito I think you were a complicated teenager with your mom I don't know but I'm, it's my guess I don't know so guys this is what we're going to talk about today basically come on family complaints especially with teenagers but i'm gonna i'm gonna share with you guys the things the parents size or the parents point of view and then the teenager size or the teenager's point of view then i'm gonna ask you some questions about that and finally guys <laughs> we're going to listen a really interesting conversation between parents and kids right maybe you will feel familiar with that i don't oh. know i don't know but yeah. let's just start with that but um, um i don't know who is new here i have i ivis is new and Ivy's. and luisito hernandez right and Rocio. no boris no Rocio. no 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 Rocio's not no Okay, guys, I want to see all your faces if it's possible. Doesn't matter if you're a completely disaster. That's okay, right, Alex? Don't worry. Nah. Nah. If you feel completely disaster, that's okay for me. Look, I'm having calm my hair. So I'm not a completely disaster, but I'm not like fancy to the ash. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had to let you know. Ah, oh, yes. Today has been like. But, but I'm so happy to have you here. So guys, let me share right now my screen. Oh, and I need to uh, show you my new presentation. You'll see, you'll see, you'll see. Okay, there you go, I'm gonna share right now my screen. Just let me know if you're able to see it, okay? Can you see? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Do you like it? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I see? like it. You see, you yes. see, see. All righty. So this is what I want you to share. Can you see it, guys? Or would you like me to make it a little bit bigger? More bigger. Bigger. What about now? Is it much better right that way? Better. Yay. Better. Okay, cool. Okay. Oops. All right. Hey, there we go. Okay. So I want you guys to pay attention to this side which is going to be the dad's side. And all the dad said, my kids. Okay, I want to know who can help me read it. Who's a dad? Okay, I think Carlito Antonio is a dad, right? Also, Alex is a dad. So, Mr. Alex, can you listen to us? Okay. Do me Don't. a favor, Alex. Yes, read for me the first one, please. Don't what? Don't help around the house don't help around the house <laughs> maybe some, this is it what every reality whatever similarity with a reality guys is mere coincidence okay cualquier parecido con la realidad es mera coincidencia all righty go ahead what about the next one alex go ahead continue 
are always texting their friends. Are always texting their friends. Okay, very good. Continue. Never listen to us. Never listen to us. <laughs> okay, continue. Eat too much junk food. Eat too much junk food. All righty. And the last one? Leave everything until the last minute. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There you go. Now let's focus on the kid size. May I ask you something, guys? Who is single right now? Who is single? Who doesn't have kids? Who is Sing single? Single is... Ben? No? No? Not single? Bane! Ah, Bane! 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 Hello, teacher. We need your help. Bane, <laughs> we need your help about that. You're you're single, I know okay. that. Okay. Right? Family. Okay, but I want to see your beautiful face today. Don't worry if you don't like to be faster. That's okay. Hello. Yeah. Hello. So you are a teenager. Hello. You're still studying. So in your case, I'm, I'm, please, I'm going to beg you, please help us read the teenager side. Okay. So let me share right now my screen with you. <laughs> okay. And let's listen. Bane. Okay, Bane, can you please read it for us? This one. My parents. Okay, okay. <sighs> Read, teacher. Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> what about now? Don't... Yes, yes. No, but but I don't want my kids. I want my parents. So I, I want you to read the right ah, okay. photo, please, of the right picture. My parents um, don't respect my privacy. Uh, no, no, the first, the, one, third. the first one. Yeah, the first one. Ah, okay. Please. Embarrass, embarrass me. Embarrass, embarrass me. me in front of my friends. Embarrass me in front of my friends. Me avergüenzan en frente de mis amigos. Number two. Don't respect my privacy. Don't respect my privacy. Okay, number three. Uh, criticize my taste in music. Criticize my taste in music. Very good. Continue. Nag me to clean clean up my room. Nag me to clean up my room. Okay. The last one. Won't let me make my own decision. Very good. May I ask you something, Bunny? This is familiar to you. <laughs> Does this happen to you? Te ha pasado a ti? Mm, Be honest. Yes. Yes, right? <laughs> okay, guys. Before we continue, before <laughs> we're going to give the, the meaning of each sentence. I want you guys to focus on the pronunciation, okay? First of all, we're going to focus on that. And then I'm going to help you with the meaning of that. So please do me a favor. Let's go to the parent side and um, repeat after me. Don't help around the house. Don't help around the house. Everybody, I want to listen to everybody. Come on. Don't help, don't help around the house. Don't help, don't help around, around, the house. around the house. What does around it mean, guys? What does it mean? ¿Qué significa? What does it mean? No ayudan en la casa. No ayudan en la casa. No ayudan en la casa. ¿Será que eso es así? Number two. Yes. Are yes. always texting their friends. Are are always always friends. What does it mean? ¿Qué significa? Están siempre están texteando, 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 texteando. Very good. Chateando. chateando, exactly. Texting. <laughs> Texting, ya sea using the phone <laughs> or email or whatever, right? Or messenger, Twitter. <laughs> okay. Never listen to no, us. No. Never, Never listen, listen to us. us. To us. us. Number four, eat too much junk food. Eat too much, much junk food. food. What does it mean, guys? Comida chatarra. No siempre, pero come mucha. Exactly. Too much. Very too good. Too much. Demasiado. Exactly. And the last one, leave everything until the last minute. Repeat it, please. Leave 
Leave everything to the, the, the last minute. The last minute. What does it mean? They had to no, 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 no. Okay, very good. <laughs> this is the parents' point of view, guys. Ese es el punto de vista de los padres, right? Que los chicos hacen esto, los jóvenes. <coughs> Hoy vamos a ver los chicos. My parents. My uh, parents. After my me, parents. embarrass me in front of my friends. Me avergüenzan en frente de mis amigos. Quiero, quiero que pronuncien esto de un solo. In front of. In front of. In front of. Acuérdense que es of, no of. Of. In front of. In front of. Very good. In front of. Don't respect my privacy. Don't respect my privacy. What does it mean, guys? What does it mean? Mm -hmm. Respeto mi privacidad. Very good. Mm -hmm. Number three, criticize my taste in music. Criticize my, 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 my taste in music. What does it mean, guys? Critica mi, mi gusto. Exactly. Nag me to clean up my room. Nag me to clean up my room. Clean up my room. Clean up my room. ¿Qué creen que significa? What do you think it doesn't mean? No. No. Me fastidian. Me fastidian. Exactly. Uh, me fastidian. Nag me. Como nag like, me is. is it's nah, like, it's me. like, for example, ya limpiaste tu cuarto. No limpiaste tu cuarto. Que te dije que limpiaste el cuarto. Like that? Just like, a, dale, 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 dale. Then I gotta do this and this and this. Nag me. Nag me to clean my room. Como que ya que demasiado, eh? Okay, and the last one. Won't let me make my own decisions. Won't let me make my own decisions. What does it mean, guys? No me dejan tomar mis propias decisiones. Exactly. So now, guys, tell me something. Which complaint seems reasonable and which one seems unreasonable? ¿Cuáles quejas son razonables y cuáles son irrazonables? Remember parent side. Quieren que se lo comparte the parent side? Mm. Para que veamos que un dinis. Okay, let me just a couple of minutes. Let me share right now the parent size and then the, okay. Let me open it right now. Let me put it a little bit bigger again. So listen carefully. I want you guys to pay attention and let me know which complaints, cuáles quejas, sounds reasonable, suenan razonables, por qué, and which one sounds unreasonable. Suenan irrazonables. ¿Y por qué? That's what I want. So let me just a couple of minutes. And we'll go back. There we go. Okay, guys. Look about uh, parents. Parent size. Which of the one, two, three, four, five uh, complaints are reasonable? Uh -huh. Who can tell me? From the parent's point of view. Desde el punto de vista del padre. Everything are reasonable. Who said that, Alex? <laughs> Alex o Carlitos o Jorgito. Ajá. Reasonable. Don't help around it's, the house. Is it reasonable, guys? Yes, yeah, it's reasonable. Yes. reasonable. Uh -huh. What about are always texting their friends? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Normally. Think about, Normal. think about parents. Okay, I want you guys to think. You are parents. Yes. So I want you guys to think like parents. Oh, <laughs> not only the kids uh, saying the, the, the father. Of course. <laughs> uh -huh. So that means this is unreasonable. Okay, okay. Never yeah. listen to us. Is it reasonable? What no. do you think? Is reasonable? Never listen to us? Yes. Uh -huh. yes. yes. Eat too yes. much junk food? Yes. Yes, it's reasonable. Yes. Yes. Leave everything until the last minute. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 Only one is unreasonable. Okay. What about the teen year size? It embarrass me in front of my friends. Is it reasonable, Vanessa? What? Is it reasonable que digan los chicos, my parents embarrass me in front of my friends? It's reasonable? No. No. What about don't respect my privacy? 
No. No. Uh, criticize my chess in music. Yeah. Um, uh -huh. Nag me to clean up my room. Reasonable. Reasonable. Yes. yes. Well, let me make my own decisions. <laughs> so guys, let me ask you something. Right now, Carlitos, Alex, Jorjito, Bree, Indinita, you think reasonable or reasonable because now you are parents, right? Uh huh. But can you just make a little refresh and return? <laughs> Years back, I don't know how many, okay? I'm not telling you 20, 30 years. No, 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 no. No ages here. Oh, Gerardito, right? Remember when you were teenagers? Yes. It was not a long time ago, right? It was yesterday. Oh, come on. Yes. Hi, Ivy. So okay, you remember, guys, did your parents make those or made those kind of complaints to you? Yes. Like, Bree, yes. you're testing yes. too much. Come on. <laughs> or yes. that guy, it's 30, 10.30. What if this guy's wanted to continue to talk to you? Tomorrow you'll have class, girl. Right? Remember that? Yes. <laughs> uh -huh. um, or when, for example, Gerardo, Alex, Carlitos, Miguelito, Jorjito, for example, the girl that they like, they start to making, like, I don't know, cualquier queja. <laughs> or cualquier, um, well, how you say that in the Spanish? Oh my God, that's the worst thing that I know that I can, I don't know the Spanish meaning. Uh, 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 no, uh, what? Wait a minute. Let me double check if I can make myself clear. Uh huh. <laughs> you like a girl, right? For example, right? Ah, yes, mm -hmm. I forgot. I remember that. And you try to invent as any excuses as you can. Right? To continue talking with the girl, to continue shouting with the girl, etc. Is that am I right or am I wrong? All right. Ah, yes. you see, <laughs> I have the guys. <laughs> ah, you see. <laughs> That's why I'm married. <laughs> okay. So do you remember, guys, that you were like that? Who was a completely disaster? A messy. You know what messy is? No, the football player. Not the mm -hmm. football player. No. Messi, that for example, your room was a completely disaster. Exactly. Not bad. Yes. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Who were who was Messi when you were a teenager? Uh -huh. Be honest. Me no. Me no. I was Messi. Okay, Jorjito <laughs> said I was Messi. Gerardito said, no, oh. me never, teacher. In my entire life, no way. <laughs> uh -huh. always, always clean. Was always clean, mess. always neat. Always nice. Always uh, nice. And, always nice. And Michael, <laughs> what about you, Michael? I was very messy. Ah, so he you see, he's honest too. Uh huh. So do you remember that your parents was telling Miguelito what happened with that room? Michael, I'm gonna clean. I'm gonna wash the clothes. Hey, where is your socks? Where are your socks? Uh -huh. Where are your shirts? Where are your underwears? We're like, yeah, you see. And your mama were asking you about that. So, guys, so th those are the complaints that we have. Right now, you have the parents' point of view. But we have to remember that we were teenagers in the past, right? <laughs> and some of you are still teenagers, like Bonnie, for example, right? She's still a baby girl, right? So those are the common complaints, right? May I ask you guys? Um, does it happen to you? Les pasó ustedes? The, the two sides? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, can you think about another complaints that dads or teenagers have that we didn't mention? A otros, otros uh, quejas, tanto del lado de padre como de madre que no hemos mencionado. Do you remember? Algún otro? This problem generational. What? It's a problem generational. Ah, ah, yes, as a problem in general. Yes, you're right about that. What about in the, in the taste of music? Does it happen to you? Or do you yes. have the same taste of music of your dad's and your and your mama? No. No. Okay. Uh, I, uh -huh. I, I was uh, uh, listening to music when my parents, it doesn't stay in, in the home. Uh, 
Mm. Ah, so well, your parents oh. went out. You were like doing oh, like yeah. I'm gonna listen to my music. You know what? I remember. Yes. <laughs> I remember. Um, what's what's that movie? Las mascotas, the life, the nah. secret life of, my, of, <laughs> yeah, the, of our the pets. Yeah, I remember that it was a, as a an a scenario mm. that. It was a dog, dog that, that, that were listening like classic music, right? <laughs> yes, and, yes. and when the owner disappeared, he started putting like a rock, metal, heavy metal. <laughs> yeah, they were like, yeah. So I think you were like <laughs> that. Wow. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What about you, Bree? I want to listen to you. I think you have a really amazing stories when you were a teenager, right? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> I don't believe her. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, uh, I, I used to listen to rock music uh -huh. when I was a teenager. Um, and my mother says, Ah, oh, don't listen, that. Really? <laughs> it's, a, it's a heavy music. <laughs> but, but what kind of music? Was it uh, uh, English rock or Spanish rock but, or heavy metal one? Rock. Ah. But, uh, rock. Yeah. It's a taboo the music in English for the. Yeah. Day. And what about your mom? What was your mom's taste of music in that time? Uh, my my mom, uh, she was um, I don't know what to say, uh, de la religión católica. Oh, those um, those are like a gospels. Mm -hmm. That those are gospels. Doesn't <laughs> matter if you're evangelic, yeah. Catholic, or gospels. And I used to and I used to listen rock music. <laughs> Now I can imagine that. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. What about you, Michael? Does that happens to you, like Brie, or no? Uh, uh, example, I uh, do you watch a movie uh, Sync in uh -huh. Spanish? Ven y canta. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, yes, I remember that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. And my father. <laughs> Uh, listen to uh, the mouse sing uh, Sinatra. Sinatra, Frank Sinatra. Yeah, that was like a 60s, right? Or 70s. Yes. yes. Yeah. Very right? good. Um, I, I listen to uh, so so. So you like uh, it, but uh, not so much. Uh, yes. You know yes. what? Yes. That, uh, that happens that. The same taste of music or the same kind of music that the parents used to listen. To. Sometimes the kids continue listening the same. Yes. I don't know if that, that happens to you. For example, mm -hmm. my mom, I remember that she used to like uh, Rafael, Procio <laughs> Bulcar, eh, what else? Ángeles Negros. Ajá. Uh -huh. No, but what was the <laughs> other one? What is the other one? Uh... <laughs> Hi, it, it, it's, it's, it's for Spain. Leodan. Uh -huh. Leodan, Jose Jose. What's the other one? Camilo Sexto. Camilo Sexto. Camilo Sexto. José, Luis, José Luis Perales. That one, that one. Yeah, I remember that. And you yeah, know what? I, no, I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know what? Roberto you know? Carlos. Uh-huh. And, and there's some kind of music that you continue like it, right? <laughs> yeah, but not all of them. No, all of them. No, no, no. But I like Rafael. I remember that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I like it. What is the other one? Ay, yeah. Rocio Jurado, Rocio Pante. I don't know. There's a lot of them. Oof. Yeah. But, but Leo Dan, I don't like it because Leo Dan is like, all the <laughs> songs are like, <laughs> right? Like, oh my God, I'm going to die for her. No way. No. Those are for depressed moments. No. Do you hmm? travel in the night in the bus? Uh -huh. Leo Dance, listen Leo Dance. Oh, I. Yeah, exactly. Really? Because you're really... Yeah, because all his songs are related to that, right? <laughs> the prayer that he lost the girl. Oh my goodness, no way. <laughs> yeah, so you see, those were funny things, but at the same time, when you when you were at teenagers, um, you have a little bit like. Rosa with your parents right but you know what I think when we were like teenagers uh, their circumstances were different right because yes. we, we, we will continue even though we have like complaints with our dads or mama and vice versa we still have a like respect for them 
right? Full of destructions and all the stops. But what happened now? Do you think it's exactly the same today? The teenagers? No. It's all right. Different. It's, it's worse, it's, right? It's more complicated. It's more complicated. Yeah. What do you it's think? Even, yeah, go ahead. Tell me, Miguelito. In the life, with the music, and um, problems, circumstance is yeah. Yeah. I, what the what like the music exactly like music? Mm -hmm. So tell me, guys, what do you think now that you are parents? Because I think Miguelito is a parent. <coughs> B, are you a mother or no yet? Miss oh. oh, No, man. right? She's a baby girl, right? Not yet. Not yet. Okay. So I think most of you are parents, except for some of you, like B, J, Vane, I think Linda and Jesse and Jamie. But guys, um, what do you think about this generation? What do you think about the teenagers situation or about dads? What do you think that are the challenges for today's dads? They are more challenged? Mm -hmm. I'm a desafios, like being mm -hmm. a dad, they being a mom. They want to be adults very, uh -huh. very speed. Mm -hmm. Very mm -hmm. fast. Very fast. Uh huh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. There are more challenges, like, for example, technology, right? Yes. Like, of technology, if you use it correctly, it could give you a lot of advantages. See, si lo usas bien, puede darte muchas ventajas. But you need to learn how to use it. Because as, way, as well, you can face a lot of difficulties, right? A lot of difficult situations. Si tú lo usas bien, good. Pero si la tecnología les usa mal, te puedes enfrentar con muchas dificultades. Hey, guys, what what are the social media that we have today? We have Facebook. What else? Yes. Facebook. Twitter. What yes. else? Twitter. 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 TikTok. Instagram. <laughs> Instagram. Uh -huh. I, have, I don't know how to use TikTok, to be honest with you. I'm old fashioned, babies. I'm old fashioned. TikTok, only Carlos. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. The, yeah, the first time I remember that I only have Tiger as an as a, as a email address. And that's it. <laughs> I never know about Gmail. I look like, but now I have to. But guys, do you have a, do you think there are advantages of disadvantages growing with your kids or dealing with your kids related to internet issues? What do you think? Do you understand my question or no? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> because everybody's like, what? What did she say? Okay. Uh, okay. ¿Habrá algunas dificultades que los padres se enfrentan hoy en día con los chicos o los adolescentes en relación a la, el uso de internet? What do you think? No. Any opinions? Yes. I, no. Necesito okay. opinions de Vane y de Vi porque son teenagers. Porque Vane <laughs> dice, no, a mí no me dicen nada. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> Pero también oh. opinions de Dina, de Brie, de Carlitos, Alex, Orjito, Miguelito, Gerardo, because they're parents. They know when I, when I came at, the better. Mm -hmm. When I came <laughs> at, uh, okay. Ya estoy viejita, teacher. <laughs> no way, Bunny. How old are you? Sorry <laughs> to ask you that. 29 or so. No, if you are old, I'm already close to the tiger. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and not to the little baby one, to the big one. No al tigrito, al tigre. Right? <laughs> no way. No, you don't look like 29. You know what? The first time that I saw you, I thought you were like 23 or no longer the 24. No. You have a baby face. <laughs> <laughs> I, because she's single. That's the reason, right? We are no parents. No te has depelado. Yes. Yeah. Uh, really? No, pero no es lo mismo. I have a little girl. Ah, you have a baby girl. Oh, pues sí. No he dicho yes. nada. Yes. <laughs> Muy <laughs> depelada. Ah, okay. But I think you or the baby girl. I think the baby girl. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. So you think, guys, you see, it's really important. So, guys, um, now I want you to listen to the conversation about this family. 
But uh, first of all, I want you guys to let me know the general scenario about what's going on, okay? The general scenario. And the second time, I'm gonna, gonna play it. I'm going to let you know what I want you to, to pay attention to, okay? But first, let's okay. listen in general, and then we're going to discuss it. Are you ready? Yes. All right, okay. those are my boys. Yeah, let me just a couple of minutes. There you go. Uh -huh. There you go. Come on. Okay. Exercise two, part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Oh. What complaint? Listen to the rest of the conversation. Come on. They change me. They change me. No way. Let me just a couple of minutes because I need to again. Come on. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Listen to the conversation. Nada que usted se equivocó, teacher. That could be the possibility. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's my yes, exactly. Guys, please. It's the, first, it's the first day, it's the first day of the week. It's the first oh. class. Tengan compasión de la teacher, please. I'm just kidding. All righty. There you go. Now, yes, teacher. Now yes. Michael, come on, don't be like that. <laughs> okay, guys. Now yes. This is the right audio. Six. Okay. No problem. Page 36, exercise two, conversation. Turn down the TV. <laughs> Part A, listen and practice. Jason, Jason, turn down the TV, please. Oh, but this is my favorite program. I know, but it's very loud. Okay. I'll turn it down. That's better. Thanks. Lisa, please pick up your things. They're all over the floor. In a minute, Mom. I'm on the phone. All right, but do it as soon as you hang up. Okay, no problem. Were we like this when we were kids? <laughs> Definitely. Aha. Uh -huh. Le resultó familiar? Does it sound familiar? <laughs> yes, teacher. Yeah, right. So tell me, guys, in your own words, in sus propias palabras, what's going on here? ¿Qué está pasando aquí? What's going on? Uh, Happy the family. Fa <laughs> the father told uh -huh. us uh, husband, uh, uh, the son, uh -huh. uh, the turn, turn off, or uh -huh. turn down, oh, I don't know. Turn down, down. down, 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 So basically, guys, this is a family, right? Yeah. yeah. How many teenagers? One or two? Two. 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 And, and the mom and the dad, four right? Uh -huh. yeah. yeah. And they're two. having a really, a really interesting conversation or what? Not really, the right? Father no. complain a lot of with the child. With the child, exactly. And also the mom, right? Okay, very good. So basically, guys, this is a conversation related to complaints with family members. Parents versus teenagers. What we were talking about, right? Now, guys, the second time, I want you guys to pay attention of the complaints for each parent. Only the complaint. So what did the dad told the guy and what did the mom tell the guy, the girl, right? That's what I want. We're going to come back and we're going to discuss. And the third time, I want you guys to pay attention about the answer that the guy gave to the parent and the girl gave to the mom. Okay, that's what I want. So first of all, Listen to that complaint about the parents' sides, and then we're gonna go to the complaint of that teenager side. Ready? Ah, oh, no, 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 no. Ready? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. That's the spirit. Come yes. on. All right. That's what I want. Energy. Very good. Woohoo! There you go. Once again. Unit six. Okay. 
No problem. Page 36, Exercise 2, Conversation. Turn down the TV. Part A. Listen and practice. Jason. Jason. Turn down the TV, please. Oh, but this is my favorite program. I know, but it's very loud. Okay, I'll turn it down. That's better. Thanks. Lisa, please pick up your things. They're all over the floor. In a minute, Mom. I'm on the phone. All right, but do it as soon as you hang up. Okay, no problem. Were we like this when we were kids? <laughs> Definitely. Aha! So, what did the parent or did the father request to the guy? ¿Qué le pidió? What did he request? Que le baje volumen uh -huh. a la tele. Turn down the TV. A la tele. Very good, Boris. Turn down the TV. Why? Because it's too loud. Because the volume was too loud. Exactly. Very good. Okay. What about the mom? What did she request to the girl? Pick up her Pick up. things. Thing. Uh -huh. uh, why? She pick up their they're in the floor. On the floor. On the floor. Very good, the Boris. Floor. Uh huh. Exactly. Uh huh. Now, guys, let's listen to the third time, and I want you guys to let me know what was the teenagers' answers. Okay. I think it will sound familiar to you too. <laughs> I think so. I'm not sure, but I think so. A hundred percent about that. There you go. Let's listen one more time. Unit 6. Okay, no problem. Page 36, Exercise 2, Conversation. <clears throat> Turn down the TV. Part A. Listen and practice. <coughs> Jason. Jason. Turn down the TV, please. Oh, but this is my favorite program. I know, but it's very loud. Okay, I'll turn it down. That's better. Thanks. Lisa, please pick up your things. They're all over the floor. In a minute, Mom. I'm on the phone. All right, but do it as soon as you hang up. Okay, no problem. Were we like this when we were kids? <laughs> Definitely. Aha, uh -huh. so... When the dad asked to turn down the TV, what did he say? Uh -huh. he said, he said, yes, I turn it down. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. It's his favorite program. The favorite program, exactly. Favorite uh -huh. program. And what about the girl? He's on the phone. She's on the phone. He's talking on the phone. Mm -hmm. In a minute, mom, she said, right? In a minute, mom, come on. Ya voy, mama. In a minute, in a minute mom, uh -huh. imagine minute. she was like doing like this. In a minute, mom, right? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm going to arreglar el buche cuando digo eso. Okay, very good. <laughs> so exactly, yeah. So guys, do me a favor. Now I'm going to share right now with you guys the, um, the dialogue. I want to share with you the, the, right now the dialogue, guys, and I want you um, to pay attention to the, exactly the expressions that the parents use to request the kids to do something. Okay, that's what I want. So let me just a couple of minutes. Yes. Yes, sir. What is? What do you say in Spanish? Uh, what is very low? What I don't I don't get it. What Michael? Cuando está muy bajito. Mister Mister Piel. Fuerte. Uh, I know. Fuerte el volumen. Do this very low. Cuando el volumen está fuerte, cuando el volumen está bajo. Uh, cuando está bajo. Uh -huh. it's, very, uh, uh, it's, very, it's very low. 
Low. It's very low. Y cuando low. está muy alto es very loud. 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 Ajá. Low. loud. Y se escribe loud. Loud. Y cuando está bajo Ajá. es low. Mira. Low, bajo. Loud. Loud. Alto. Puede ser parecido. Si tú se fijas, no se pronuncia igual ni se escribe igual. Te lo voy a, que lo voy a escribir acá para todos. Deja ver. Please, uh -huh. teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Low, low puede ser bajo, pero bajo de volumen. Uh -huh. Y loud. Puede ser alto. Alto de, alto de volumen. Le pongo alto de volumen para que no crean que es alto de alguien de estatura, ¿no? Ya. Yeah. Low, loud. Loud. Mm -hmm. Because it's very loud or it's very low. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Low, pero bajo de volumen. Very good. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, guys. ¿Algo más? ¿Sí? ¿Estamos bien? Yeah, so far the good. Okay. Yes, teacher, thanks. Very, you're more than welcome. So, entonces, vamos a ver qué tal. All right, I'm going to put it a little bit bigger. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. I want you guys to pay attention to this one. There we check. Okay, cool. Let me share right now my screen. There you go. Okay. Okay, guys, this is the conversation. This is the conversation that you have just listened to. All right. So do me a favor. This is the first time that the parent intervention, right? So do you see this expression? Turn down the TV, please. Mm. Turn down the TV. Okay. He answers, right? I'll turn it down. Mm -hmm. What about the, the mom? What is the expression that she used to ask her daughter to to clean her area. Do you listen here? Pick up your things, right? Pick up your things. Uh-huh, there's another one, you see? Hang up. Uh-huh. What do you think are these guys? Turn down the TV. Pick up, hang up. What do you think they are? ¿Qué piensan que son? Uh, no. Pick up, turn up, turn down, etc. Hang up. Guys, those are verbs. Son verbos. Those are verbs. Pero no son cualquier clase de verbos. En inglés, in, in our, our uh, culture, en nuestra cultura, eh, English is like abbreviation. ¿Sí? So es como abreviatura. A nosotros, in our case, we love to use those verbs. Nos encanta usar ese tipo de verbos. Hang up, pick up, turn down, turn up, etc. Why? Because it makes our life easy and our conversation shorter. ¿Sí? Those verbs, guys, we know, se conocen como Two verbs. Two verbs. O lo que se conoce como phrasal verbs también. En los phrasal verbs, we have two word verbs and we have three word verbs. Que son como verbos compuestos de tres palabras y el verbo two word verb compuesto de dos palabras. ¿Sí? Los three word verbs son casi, son, son, no, no hay muchos, pero los two word verbs, los phrasal verbs, hay un puño. Hay un puño. ¿Por qué se llaman two word verbs? Porque son verbos que están compuestos de dos palabras, pero que obviamente las palabras son, si usted lo hace eh, single, significa una cosa y significa otra, right? But when you join it, cuando usted lo junta, when you join it, it means something else. Significa otra cosa. ¿Sí? For example, Pick. Agarrar. Pick. Se lo acabo de poner ahí. ¿Por qué me sale solo a Carlitos? Si yo no quiero Carlitos, quiero a todo el mundo. 
Pic. Mm. No crean que no crean que eso es así como cuello, ¿eh? No, 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 no. no. <risa> he, he is not the big Duncan, así no se preocupen. Pic. Pic es uno solo, right? Pic. Mm -hmm. Y pic es como agarrar. Y normalmente up, up, es algo para arriba, ¿no? Up, ¿sí? Ajá. Pick, agarrar y up, arriba. Ok, pero cuando nosotros unimos esas dos palabras, pick up significa levantar, Reco. pero levant, levantar o recoger de una superficie, ¿sí? De una superficie. ¿Sí? Eso, chicos, es, le voy a decir algo, no para asustarlo, pero es la realidad. Esta, pick up, en este contexto, este es uno de los 18 significados de la palabra pick up. Sí. Porque este phrasal verb tiene 18 formas de utilizarse. Solo ese. Yes, solamente. Yes, solamente. <risa> only that, only that, Van. Yes. yes. <risa> solamente. Lástima que no tengo este librito por aquí. Yo tengo un librito solo de phrase hoppers. Si alguien sabe, si alguien ha visto el código penal del de Salvador, es exactly like that. <risa> <risa> yes. Boy. Entonces, sí. Yes, Michael. Mm -hmm. Entonces, pick up. En este caso, en este contexto, Right? que lo usó la mamá, pick up, significa levantar o recoger del suelo. Por eso se llama, esto es lo que vamos a ver nosotros, pick up, pero no lo vamos a ver todos porque <ríe> son más de mil phrasal verbs. <ríe> son más, pero vamos a ver lo que comúnmente se utilicen para demandar que alguien haga algo, ¿sí? To do, por ejemplo, que alguien te haga un favor, to ask for a favor, ¿sí? También en el caso de ustedes, con los, con los chiquillos, que hagan algo, ¿sí? Por ejemplo, tú le dices, por favor, recoge los trastes, saca la basura, ¿sí? Ordena los juguetes, etc. So, we're going to see those kind of phrasal verbs, or two word verbs, que utilizamos para demandar que alguien haga algo, ¿sí? Eso es lo que vamos a aprender. Se llama two part verbs y los vamos a ver, chicos, eh, para responder a requests. Los vamos a ver los two part verbs con nouns, con nombres, with pronouns, con pronombres y los vamos a ver respuesta y también como usted lo pregunta, ¿sí? Como, re, como usted request that somebody do something y cómo responde a ese request. Eso es lo que nos vamos a enfocar tomorrow. ¿sí? Va a ser un como grammar. Ah, yo sé que a usted le encanta la grammar. Sí. Y a mí también. <ríe> yeah. Pero va a ser muy, muy importante. ¿Por qué? Porque, chicos, no todos los phrasal verbs, lo que vamos a ver mañana sí, pero no todos los phrasal verbs se puede usar por ejemplo, con un pronombre al final o con un pronombre en medio. No todos. Hay unos que no se puede usar, que no se puede como cambiar eh, la manera en que usted lo escribe en una oración. A veces sí y a veces no. Entonces se los tiene que aprender así a guayaba. Don't worry, Carlitos. Pero no, pícate no, no, no. bien fácil. Desde... The, the question is, is that, Dígame, señor. Uh, there are um, the rules for this. Yes, uh, there are rules. Y se las uh, vamos a enseñar mañana. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. Vamos okay, a aprender, okay. por ejemplo, lo que, nos, lo que utilizamos comúnmente en casa. Por ejemplo, turn down, ¿sí? ¿Se acuerdan que el señor le dijo turn down the TV? ¿Se recuerdan de eso? Okay. Yeah. Yes. Vamos a ver el turn down con nouns, con pronouns. Vamos a ver eh, el pick up también con nouns y pronouns y vamos a ver otros más así que don't worry ¿sí? no se me preocupe pero es incluso si les voy a dar solo esos dos también les voy a enseñar cuál va a ser la regla la regla 
Y fíjate qué regla, no solamente para pronunciar las, eh, las palabras, los phrasal verbs, sino también para poder escribirlo. Vamos a ver turn off, por ejemplo, que no es lo mismo que turn down. Fíjense, si no creyeran, no es lo mismo. Turn on y turn down y turn off no es lo mismo. ¿Sí? Ya, ya vamos a ver eso. Uh -uh, no es lo mismo que turn down. Y alguien creería que sí. Y en Bruce, like, oh, mm -hmm. I feel scary, teacher. Don't be scary. No. Fíjate que sí, me, me gustaría. Que, que tuviéramos algún día una presencial. Y sabes, yo te regalaría una copia de ese libro que yo tengo. What is the name, the eh, no está aquí. Really? No. 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 Pero es, 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 es No, solamente the phrasal words. Es así y es así. Wow. Les es... estaba diciendo que Pickup tiene 18 maneras de utilizarlo. Y fíjate que ese libro es bien chivo porque te da, te da el phrasal verb, ¿sí? Te da a la par la palabra normal y que, que se podría decir que es como similitud con el phrasal verb y te da el, el significado en español y te da un ejemplo de una oración. Es bien chivo, en parte, y no porque tiene otras más cosas, es un libro bien completo. Pero sí me gustaría darte aunque sea una copia de eso. Hubiera sido genial. Algún día lo veré. Ok. Y algún día se los traeré. A ver si algún día podemos hacerlo presencial. También. <risa> One day, right? One day. Sí, voy a ver si lo, si lo encuentro, que saben que lo, tengo días de buscarlo y no lo encuentro. Menos mal que me, me acuerdo de un montón de cosas. Pero sí lo voy a buscar y se, voy a ver si se los puedo enseñar mañana, hoy. Tomorrow. Okay. Y bueno... You know what? I know that you love me, guys, and I love you too. But I have to let you know that it's time to say goodbye. Oh, no. Hey, how was your first class? It was amazing. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I'm so happy. Guys, this is our first class. And I'm nice because it's today is the first day. But tomorrow, uh, hey, guys, this model, you got to study harder. Because this model, we're going to see a topics. A little bit harder than the last model. Okay? Okay, okay guys. Kisses. So hot okay. and kisses. Have an amazing night and enjoy your dinner, Carlitos. <laughs> <laughs> bye. 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 Bye